Hello everyone, this is VGS and welcome to the new series which I've been waiting for for too long. We've been saying we're going to do a tutorial series and we are finally going to start it. So the very first tutorial series or uh, tutorial is going to be how to install MMD and MME because believe it or not, 90% of the questions I've asked in comment sections are what program is this and where do you get it. So before we even teach you how to install it, there's three things we need to tell you. First thing, you need a Windows PC. Yes, you can get it on your phone, but it's not as good. And yes, you can get it on a Mac slash Linux if you have a virtual system. If you're trying to figure out how to do a virtual system, I have done one before, but I do not recommend it. So if you need to learn how to, you know, make a virtual system, just type in on YouTube how to install a virtual system for Windows so you can use this program. That's all you need to do. Second thing you need you need your redistribute packages 64 that means you need your 2008 your 2010 and your direct line you need those three things installed on your computer for MMD to work now you're probably wondering what is that like how do I get that I'm gonna show you that later on in the video it's where you download MMD and it will be right there near it now the last thing you would need to figure out if your computer is 64 or 32 and I'm gonna figure it out for you your computer is 64 if you're using a 32 bit, that's your computer is probably really, 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 really old. And it's probably running Windows 2000, which I don't think no one can run Windows 2000. Now, in the description, you'll find two links one to MME and one to MMD. Technically, the link is to the same page, but it will make it easier for you to click on each one, I guess. Or you can scroll down, it's up to you. So, the first one is MMD. So, we're going to scroll down and you're going to find this right here. It's what we're looking for, and this is what I'm going to tell you about the redistribute packages. If you scroll down, you will see this right here. It's what we're looking for, right here. Now, when you install MMD, if you don't have this stuff installed, you pretty much don't, you can't use MMD, you have to install this stuff. But you don't know if you have it, well, I, if you play any kind of games off of Steam, that's newer type games, you should have this installed already on your computer. If you don't know, you can go to your control panel, and I'm not going to go through all that to show you, but you can go to your control panel to see, and all you can just, you know, click on each one and install it. It doesn't matter if you already have the newest one, let's say you have 2015 or something, or you already have a 2010 on it, it will still install the up-to-date version regardless, because it doesn't download from this website, it downloads from Microsoft, like, servers. So you, it would be okay if you reinstall it, if you don't think you have it or not. So make sure you have it, install it, make sure you get this one, the 64-bit, do not get a 32-bit, because that, yeah, that's no point. So get this right here. Now, after you download all those and install it, this is when it comes in handy. You click right here, just click on the 64-bit and click, and it installs it. When that's done installing, you drag it to your desktop. Now the second link is MME, the effects you see us do in our videos, those are used from MME. So what we're going to do is go to the second link, and the second link may already be you know, connected to the MME thing so you don't have to scroll down, but if you notice it's the same exact website. So this is what you need to get to right here, it's about halfway down. So we're looking at here, we got MME and MME64. Get this one, the yellow one. Do not get the green one because you do not have a 32-bit system. You have a 64-bit. So get 64-bit, click, download, bam. You're done. That's, that's, you got MMD downloaded, MME downloaded. Now what we need to do is install them. Drag it to your desktop like this. Now if you have a second monitor or a third monitor, you can do it either way. So right now what we need to do is make a photo. I'm going to call it MMD1 because if you haven't noticed, I already have MMD installed. So I don't want to overwrite anything. Okay, so here we go. We're going to open up the Miki Miki Dance thing for us. Let's install this. We have this. Open up this photo. I'm going to try to make it drag to that thing because I don't want to drag it all over to my other screen. Okay, here we go. You get this right here, you open this up, you see all that, but you, you don't want that, you just want this. Drag. Bam. You have MMD installed now. Second thing, you can get rid of this now, you don't need it. Second thing, this, MME. 
Now, this is thought a little bit different. Open it up. You just need this one, this one, and this one. You don't need nothing else. Drag that and drag it inside the folder where it'd be like this. This is what it looks like. Data, user file, then MMD, I mean ME is all this. And this is the application. Now I will go through the user files and on the next video how to how to um, install a motion and how to use a model how to use a motion and how to put a wave in so I will tell you all that uh, next Monday but now if you double click on the icon it should launch the program and if you have this up top which is called MME effect you did it right everything's installed right you have everything you know ready to go you can carry on on your first thing if you find another video that shows you how to do a model motion all that kind of stuff then go ahead and you know jump into it and you can wait for us to catch up on our tutorials and then you can get more advanced into making your own video so i thank you for watching and if you have any questions please leave a comment down below and we will um, answer as quickly as possible and we will see you next monday